The best Ultrabook represents the ideal no-compromise laptop for most people, thin and light, with great battery life, yet still fast and responsive. The Ultrabook label was introduced to distinguish the very best Intel-powered Windows laptops, those designed to compete with the power and portability of the best MacBooks like the MacBook Air. So, whether you want to do intensive photo or video editing on the go, or simply have a do-it-all laptop for work and play, the best Ultrabooks can take pretty much anything you can throw at them. However, because they are high-end, zero-compromise laptops, Ultrabooks aren't cheap. If you're on a budget and can live without the familiarity of the Windows operating system and some outright speed, check out the best Chromebooks. These offer similar and sometimes better portability and battery life to most Ultrabooks and can be a fraction of the price. These days, the term Ultrabook isn't used all that often, so you're unlikely to see many laptops specifically labeled as one. The laptops in this video confirm the Ultrabook ethos of being super thin and light, while offering slick, speedy performance and all while sipping battery power. We have listed the top 5 Ultrabooks and their key features, plus the things you need to consider to help you choose the best one for you. Links to all the products mentioned in the video are in the description below. You could also find a more detailed analysis and a comparison tool on our website, guidinggear.com. Number 5. Razer Blade 14 PC gaming and portability don't usually go hand in hand. Oftentimes, compromises need to be made. But with the Razer Blade 14, those are few and far between. Razer has managed to squeeze some insane hardware into a laptop under 4 pounds and well below an inch thick. A 14-inch QHD display offers an impressive 165Hz refresh rate and FreeSync support, so you're in for a great tear-free gaming experience. But it's on the inside that really blows you away. That solid display is powered by an AMD Ryzen 9 6900HX processor with an equally impressive NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3070 Ti graphics card. This machine is ready for whatever game you throw at it, and it'll also handle video editing like a champ. Heck, you can even do some overclocking. Doting a 16GB DDR5 RAM and 1TB of SSD storage ensures it'll speedily chug along, and Wi-Fi 6E support lets you enjoy fast connectivity for your on-the-go battle station, or you can park it at your desk to play and connect it directly to a gaming monitor with the laptop's full-size HDMI port. Number 4. HP Spectre The HP Spectre X360 has been one of the best laptops for years now, and the 2021 model is no different. Now coming with 11th generation Intel Core processors, which offers a decent performance boost and featured better integrated Intel Iris Xe graphics, the HP Spectre X360 is better than ever. It still features the impeccable twin one design and the pristine gem cut chassis that these laptops are known for, meaning that the HP Spectre X360 is one of the best looking Ultrabooks ever made when it comes to build quality. While it's certainly pricey, you're getting some excellent extras, such as formidable security features and Bang & Olufsen speakers. If you care about aesthetics as much as you do performance and overall quality, this is the best Ultrabook for you. Number 3. LG Gram 17 The case for choosing a laptop with a jumbo screen, one larger than 15 inches has never been stronger. The much improved LG Gram 17 with a gorgeous 17-inch QHD display is exhibit number 1. This 179999 laptop is fresh with an 11th generation Intel Core i7 processor, a redesigned keyboard and touchpad, and a sleek black livery. It's unquestionably the best 17-inch laptop you can buy if you're not a gamer or multimedia content creator. The underwhelming 2019 model has ceded the stage to an all-new edition for 2021. The lightweight chassis and brilliant QHD screen remain, but LG got serious about the rest of the user experience. This means not only a better keyboard and touchpad, but also a better-looking laptop that boasts Intel's latest silicon and incredible battery life. The thin font Gram logo is embossed on the display lid in silver, while the rest of the lid is an uninterrupted expanse of black magnesium alloy. It looks much better than the grey exterior of the previous Gram 17 model, which featured curved edges, perhaps an attempt at retro styling, but mostly just doji looking. The base of the laptop is nearly identical to last year's. The edges taper slightly from back to front, although the base remains the same thickness throughout. Number 2. Dell XPS 13 the Dell XPS 13 OLED is what happens when the best laptop meets the latest display technology. Combining the two creates something close to magic, an ultra-portable device capable of running most tasks while providing a cinema-like viewing experience. Everything you love about the other XPS configuration remains, including the fast performance, striking design, and top-rated touchpad. 
The latest XPS 13 model debuts a gorgeous OLED panel that provides rich picture quality for when you're streaming movies at home or editing videos for work. Is it worth the trade-off to battery life? If you need a high-res display, then yes. The 3.5K OLED display outlasted the 4K IPS config in our battery test and is capable of producing a wider range of colors. Equipped with an Intel Core i7 1185G7 CPU with 16GB of RAM, the XPS 13 is small but mighty. Overall, the XPS 13 OLED brings an excellent display upgrade to what was already a favorite laptop and it does so without many sacrifices. Number 1. Apple MacBook Air If you take a quick look at the newest MacBook Air, you might think it looks like almost nothing has changed. Outwardly, you'd be right. It's the exact same shape and size, even weighing just as much as its predecessor. But Apple has made some dramatic changes under the hood. Namely, Apple switched away from Intel's processor and introduced its own Apple M1 system on a chip. This puts its CPU, GPU, memory, and more all onto the same chip and its sum chip. The Apple M1 features four high-performance cores and four high-efficiency cores, letting it speed through some tasks while sipping energy when doing more basic work. These new processing cores also give the new MacBook Air a big boost in battery life. What's truly impressive is that Apple has made this switch to a new chip that operates very differently from Intel's chip, yet the operating system and apps are running just fine despite needing a translation layer for many apps to function. The new architecture is also closer to what you'd find in Apple's phones, so iOS apps on macOS should run with ease. Apple's new MacBook Air takes a big step in new direction, and it looks like Apple's got its footing right. Buying Guide these days, non-businesses' laptops rarely carry the chipmaker's official Ultrabook label, but many people still use the term to describe super thin and light laptops of all kinds. If you're shopping for one, consider the following. If you want a system that's really easy on your arms, look for one that weighs 3 pounds or less. What good is a highly portable laptop if you need to recharge it every few hours? Look for systems that lasted at least 9 hours on the laptop mag battery test. Decide what ports you absolutely need before you buy. Some Ultrabooks only have USB Type-C or Thunderbolt 3 ports, while others have a mix of both next-gen and legacy connectors. If you're buying a 2-in-1, a touchscreen comes standard. However, if you're getting a clamshell laptop, touch may cost extra and could drain battery life. Let us know in the comments which model works for you the best and why. Thank you for watching the video and that is all for this one. If you find this video helpful in any way, give a huge thumbs up, stay tuned for the upcoming videos by subscribing to our channel. Hope to see you in the next video. Till next time, see you guys later.